Summer break for students is just around the corner. Oh my gosh, already it's coming. So that means the dreaded phrase, I'm bored. I'm bored. Joining us this morning is local education expert, Elise McGregor. You're gonna show us how to turn some of our stuff into something fun and educational. Cause a lot of us with kids, we have all this stuff all at of home. It. But we don't know where all of the pieces are, no. but we have all of these things, but, Elise. And we could use it in a different way. Yeah, and so summer brain drain is a real thing. Mm -hmm. And it shows that children pre-K through high school can lose up to two to three months of That's reading and math. It is. Mm -hmm. And so there's a lot of a lot of stuff at home, um, particularly Legos. They're a great thing to do with um, making letters. Mm -hmm. Okay. You could also do patterning with them. Mm -hmm. There's um, you, you made the counting. H for Heather. That was Thank really you. nice. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that was. I um, <laughs> also made some letters. I had some kiddos over yesterday mm -hmm. making um, with Play-Doh and mm -hmm. so Play-Doh is another thing just like Legos you can make letters, right. you can do numbers. Yeah, you can do sight words on here yeah. for the kids if they're learning. Very cool. Love yeah. Like that. Right. So those kiddos were five and then um, dice are fun for similar reasons. They yeah, can count. you want to you teach can... your kids craps mm -hmm. really early. <laughs> I had a feeling gambling. Right. You need to teach the kids gambling. So I was steer steering it this no, way. We don't. And so um, not only for quantity recognition right. with children, you know, I think we teach them one, two, three, the actual numbers, mm -hmm. but we're not teaching them how much something is. Mm -hmm. So they can also add, you know, five and five is ten, right. various things they'll have a heyday with different ways that to play with the dice. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Patterning with checkers. Um, I made ABAB, AABB, -A -B -B, oh. and then, um, you know, it's just keep them entertained. You know, we do a lot of this with Connect Four. If yeah. anybody has a Connect Four game, my little ones call it coins because they don't know how to play yet, but they yeah. can do the patterns and it really, it really gets it, their brain going and gets their brain moving. It's a math skill and I brought cards for the same reason so they could do red and black. They could also do numbering. Mm -hmm. um, all these things parents have at home and then simply. You know, they teach, they teach cribbage in like third grade, it's, fourth grade. Mm -hmm. So this idea is something that these younger kids, especially, they are gonna learn these mm -hmm. things yeah. in school because the gaming is a great way to, mm -hmm. to teach this to stuff. To engage I them. Think. And yeah. at Little Newtons, we have different various ways to do these things throughout the day. So we're not just educating them in more of a traditional way, whether they're playing structured free play, mm -hmm. then they'll pull out the Duplos Fun. and start right. doing yeah. that. I love this idea because we just spent last week in scrubbing our tree house from all of the Paint oh, that, uh, sure. that got on there. Just so water. Painting with water. I never yeah. would have thought of this. This is great. It definitely. I mean, and then it dries and they can use it again. And you could add salt in there as well. And then it'll have kind of a texture. Oh, and it'll leave okay. the residue. And you yeah. can do that on fences. You can do it on houses. You're a tremendous yeah. artist, Elise. Yeah. That was that was, <laughs> that was that was hard work right there. Yeah, you did. That's that abstract. Was abstract. Little abstract. <laughs> That's what I was just it's good say. to teach that abstract. to the kids too. Yeah. Really great, Elise. Uh, obviously, at uh, Little Newton's doing mm -hmm. all of this kind of stuff. We appreciate you sharing some of these Thank tips you. with parents yeah. today. Yeah, sharing how parents can teach kids stuff when they don't feel like they're learning. <laughs> Sneaky exactly. learning. <laughs> That's the way to right go. In there. Thank you. <laughs>